Hi, I'm Caitlin Soto. And welcome to Aggie Academy. In today's lesson, I'll show you what it takes to be a good free throw shooter. Once you get to the free throw line, now it's time to shoot a free throw. The first thing you're gonna do is line your foot up in the middle of the court and get square to the basket. In the center of the basket, there's typically a dot in the middle of the court. And if you're right-handed, I like to line my right foot up at the dot to make sure I'm perfectly square. If I was left-handed, I would line my left foot up at the dot so that I'm perfectly square to the basket. Late in the game, you normally are very tired, so it's very important for you to bend your leg. So when you're gonna shoot a free throw, you wanna come down about 90 degrees. Not too low and not like this, about 90 degrees, and then that'll give you the power you need to get the ball to the basket. Once we go down to shoot the ball, it's gonna be one continuous motion. Notice that my arm is in an L, and that this is called the shooting pocket. You wanna keep the ball in your shooting pocket. Notice that my hands are lined up with the seams, and that my fingers are spread apart to gently guide the ball to the basket. The final step in shooting a free throw is actually letting the ball go off your fingers. Once you come down, you're gonna be in full extension, and the ball is going to come off of your pointer finger and your middle finger. The final thing to do is to put all the three steps together to bend your legs, one full motion, and watch your follow through. I'm Caitlin Soto, and it's nothing but net. <laughs>